Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and in this one I'm going to show you my item shop predictions for tomorrow's item shop which means for February 6, 2021. Before the video starts, we actually predicted the haze game correctly. So if you guys are here to watch more accurate item shop prediction videos then you are totally at the right place. Drop a like on this video, subscribe to my channel and turn your post notifications on to never miss out any of my upcoming daily Fortnite item shop prediction videos and as well as sometimes when I'm going to return slash comeback videos and ranking videos. And as well, just a quick disclaimer to those cosmetics that I'm about to predict in today's video, they are not 100% confirmed if they are going to be in the next item shop because in the end, these are just my predictions, my guesses. But just in case if some of you didn't know, that whenever the Fortnite is keep bringing back these cosmetics in these days item shops, okay, their last scenes are always being between 25 to 45 days ago. With all being said, those cosmetics that I'm about to predict in today's video, their last scenes are also between 25 to 45 days ago, and that means there are more than 50% of chance of arrival of each skin. Enough for the talk, let's go ahead into the video. Okay, let's start with the special items. First, we might be having the Mogul Master skin. Now, since she came back in the item shop at February 10th last year because of the Elfine Championship Tournament, that's why we could possibly be having her back again in the item shop uh, in a couple of days, at February 10th. Yeah, in 5 days, okay? So it's gonna be here with 90% of chance of arrival. Now we have the Eon skin. As you guys know that the Eon skin it is a Xbox One exclusive skin, right? But since some leakers have seen that there is a item shop design of her, we might be having her in the item shop for the first time ever with 92% of chance of arrival. Next up, we have the ZD and as well as the metal version. They both are Valentine skins, or I'm gonna say Valentine event skins in the end. So, and as you guys know, that we are approaching to the Valentine, so we might be having both of them in the item shop pretty soon. Maybe in tomorrow's item shop, who knows? With 95% of chance of arrival. Now, we have the Travis Scott skin. Travis Scott skin, it was last seen as well a while ago, but since some leakers have said that it's gonna be coming to the item shop pretty soon, and other than that, um, they both were added, like, were added into the previous patch, and as well as in this patch, I guess, into the current patch. Uh, that's why we could possibly be seeing them in the item shop pretty soon. Now, you guys can check out my two other videos with me talking about the return release date of the uh, Travis Scott and as well as the Zeta skin according to my predictions. So go and check it out. Click at the link in the description. Now we have the uh, Harley Quinn skin. So on Twitter from Fortnite News it says in the V15.30 update a new Batman icon was added into the files. We could potentially see another Batman X Fortnite crossover. I'm say collaboration in the near future. This is just pure speculation. It does not confirm anything. So here's how the Batman icon looks like, okay? So basically it says that there's gonna be a new skin coming, but in the end it is not confirmed at all, okay? So let's say if, if we are going to see a new skin, okay? And just because the Batman skin and as well as the Harley Quinn, they both are from the same crew, the DC crew. That's why I'm gonna be predicting the Harley Quinn skin with the Batman skin, um, because they are both are in the same crew, okay? So yeah, with 97% of chance of arrival, but they're just not confirmed at all, okay? So yeah. Now, the future items. First, we might be having the superhero skins, which in game it is pretty much called the Boundless Set. As you guys know, they were lasting between 25 to 45 days ago. And other than that, they got nerfed. Like pretty much, Epic just removed the black and the white versions, and as well, uh, they just got disabled from the competitive game modes. That's why I'm gonna say that they might be here with 96% of chance of arrival. Okay. So yeah, they just removed it and they just nerfed it, like I said, and they were lasting between 25 to 45 days ago. So yeah. Next up, we have the Lovely and the Color King skin. They both are uh, Valentine skins, but they are just leaked, but they're gonna be coming to item shop pretty soon. So I'm gonna say with 99% of chance of arrival since we're approaching to the Valentine's event. Next up, the Dark Vanguard skin. The price of the 2000 v it was lasting between 25 to 45 days ago, and it's gonna be here with 64% of chance of arrival. Next up, we have the uh, Blaze skin. The price that is 2,000 V-Bucks. It was last seen in the item shop between 25 to 45 days ago, and it's going to be here with 67% of chance of arrival. Next up, we have the Little Whip skin, which is pretty much the ice cream skin. Uh, the price that is 1,500 V-Bucks, and it's going to be here with 78% of chance of arrival. Okay, so yeah. Now let's start predicting the cosmetics as of the part from the daily items. So first we have the Sushi skin, which is pretty much the Mac Master skin in game. The price, what the hell was that accent? The price is 1200 V-Bucks and um, it's gonna be here with 70, 
9% of chance of survival. We have the Clock Shadow skin, the price it is 1500 V-Bucks and it's going to be here with 86% of chance of survival because it was less in the item shop as well between 25 to 45 days ago. Next up, the Manic skin. The price it is 800 V-Bucks. It was also last seen between 25 to 45 days ago and it's going to be here with 66% of chance of arrival. Next we have the Scarlet Commander skin. The price it is 800 V-Bucks again just like the Manic skin. It was last seen between 25 to 45 days ago and it's going to be here with 88% of chance of arrival. Now I'm going to show you guys my two last predictions. We have the uh, Poke Emote and as well as the Star One Pickaxe. The price that is 800 V-Bucks. It was last in the item shop between 25 to 45 days ago and as well as the Poke Emote. And the price that is 500 V-Bucks for the Poke Emote and the Star One that is 800 V-Bucks. And it's going to be here. I mean the Star One Pickaxe is going to be here with 75% of chance of arrival. And the Poke Emote is going to be here with 62% of chance of arrival. So if you guys found this video helpful, drop a like, subscribe, and turn the post notifications on if you guys want to see more of those daily Fortnite item shop prediction videos mostly, and as well as ranking and when will it return slash comeback videos, and sometimes leaked videos, okay? Um, subscribe to my channel guys, you won't regret at all for more 75% of accurate uh, cosmetics. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you to the next video. Have a good one.